It's Kansas City like you've never seen it before, made of those tiny colorful blocks that never lose their luster, no matter how old you are. Today, we're getting a sneak peek at Casey's new brickyard. Fox News' Kathy Quinn is live at Legoland Discovery Center at Crown Center, and she's got more for us. Kathy? Oh my goodness, we thought, you know, we've shown you this landmarks built up with the Legos, about one and a half million of these Lego bricks. And I thought, I'm gonna bring Mr. Master Builder in here. We've been talking to him all morning long, Jeremiah and Elizabeth as well to show us how they could put something together. I don't know how you did that in just a few minutes. I mean, <laughs> you were in a competition to become the master builder. Yep, there was uh, myself and 171 other contestants. Uh, three rounds, whittled it down in the top 12, and, and I got the title of master model builder. What is your secret? Because it's taken, you know, this is what I came up with. Let me show you. Not very creative. I didn't play with Legos when I was little. You obviously did. Yeah. What is your secret? You know, there, there it goes. <laughs> oh, I think after a while you just uh, memorize which bricks are available, and so that's what you're searching for as far as in the bin, that kind of thing, whether you're going for a certain color scheme or, or a certain type of brick. And I don't know, it's just, uh, just memory. So. I love that. There's your nice little barn there. And Elizabeth is here. Man, oh, man, you played with Legos when you were younger, too. I did. I did. I went and so what did you do? What did you start? off with? Uh, what I started off with in this thing was just a little train set and just start building from there and making kind of an animal train. Um, growing up I started playing with my my big brother's Lego sets and then my parents bought me my own so I loved, I loved it so much. And here we are three adults in Legoland <laughs> playing with all these Legos. Let's take a look at some of the statistics. There are actually two million Lego bricks within the part where the kids can play, right? Yes. yes. That's correct. Yes. Okay. And then one and a half million Lego bricks to build the Emerald City and the Kansas City landmark. Yes, there are a million and a half bricks in our mini land, and then two million uh, within the attraction that the kids have to, to build and create whatever they can imagine. Now, you are now working here full time for Legoland, and you're building what you did when you were little. Sunday, it's going to open up. You excited? I'm very excited. That's our big day. Uh, we're going to have uh, uh, Buddy. He's our uh, Lego minifigure mascot. He's going to be leading the parade on in, and we're going to have a ribbon cutting ceremony. And so it's going to be it's going to be a lot of fun. All right, get back to work. All Let's right. figure. We're going to figure something else out. All right, Kathy Quinn, Fox 4 News, and back to you, Nick. Did you play with Legos when you were little? Yeah, I, Legos. And mm -hmm. Kathy, you probably remember the Lincoln Logs, don't you? Why, was that way long ago? No! <laughs> I, I wasn't much of a builder. <laughs> hey, one, one thing before you go, Kathy, of all yes. the landmarks that have been made of Legos, which one is your favorite? I believe the plaza, the Country Club Plaza, because it has a fountain that actually has water, and it's beautiful. It just, just gorgeous. And this, of course, took six months to come up with the landmarks and took 20 people to build it. So yes, it really cool. And you were one of them. Yes, I was. Ah, see, awesome. there you have it. Come on down and see. It. I know Gus will love it. Yeah, he and I will be down there soon. Kathy, thanks a lot. That okay. looked really cool. Mm -hmm. Legoland Discovery Center opens on Sunday at 930 at Crown Center. $19 for adults, 15 bucks for kids and uh, free to kids under two years old.